this round two organelle mitochondria and chloroplast special about mitochondria and chloroplast they're also known as the energy quality organelle or semi-autonomous why they have a set known as a semi-autonomous they can grow and produce independent independently in cell so these two organelle not parts under the endo membrane system they have a double membrane for mitochondria, there are two membranes enclosed uh, with a phospholipid bilayer, which is this phospholipid bilayer. They have a unique collection of protein embedded, and this protein we use to transport the substrates in cellular respiration. We discuss detail in chapter 5. Um, the outer layer for mitochondria are smooth compared to inner layer are convoluted with infolding we call Christi. Uh, yeah. In chloroplast, also double membranes, this double membrane uh, to separate uh, or partition uh, from the cytosol. These two, um, uh, the double membrane in chloroplast are very narrow uh, intermembrane space. Okay. And another point uh, for both organelles, they are contain protein made up by free ribosome and contain circular DNA. So they have their own ribosome, their own DNA. So basically, they can produce their own enzyme. Um, this mitochondria site for cellular respiration to produce chemical energy. Uh, the common one is a ATP. In chloroplast, uh, we can find in plant cell, can found in algae as a site for photosynthesis. Mitochondria are found in nearly all eukaryotic cells, including plants, animal, and fungi. Some cells have a single large mitochondria, but some has hundreds, even thousands of mitochondria. This double membrane form a two compartment. Okay, uh, the first one is a uh, intermembrane space, and the second one is a matrix. Okay, what the difference between a two compartment? The inner membranes are narrow region between outer membranes and inner membranes, and the matrix. They have enclosed by inner membrane. The outer mitochondria membrane is smooth and allows some molecule to pass. And the inner mitochondria membrane strictly regulates molecules that move across it and fold it into Christi. Mitochondria matrix has many different enzymes, mitochondria DNA and a ribosome. Enzyme in matrix of mitochondria catalyze some step of cellular respiration to make it ATP. Mm, high folded surface, the Christi gives the inner mitochondria a large surface area. This large surface area gives uh, high products of cellular respiration, example ATP. Okay, this figure show a uh, mitochondria. We have a double membrane. The outermost layer here we know as the outer membrane and inner membrane. Okay, between outer and inner is first compartment. We know as an intermembrane space. Okay, a yellow color. And inside the inner membrane, okay, the enclosed here is a crystal, a folded. And this folded of Christi give high surface area to produce high numbers of chemical energy or ATP. Okay, next we go to the second organelle and the energy coveting is the chloroplast. Chloroplast is a member of family of organelle called plastic. What is plastic? A family of a membrane enclosed of organelle that produce and store food material in a cell of plant and algae. Okay, the this chloroplast 
uh, an organelle that contain a chlorophyll, a green pigment that trap light energy for photosynthesis. This chloroplast also contain a variety of light, absorbing yellow and orange pigment known as carotenoid. Okay, these chloroplasts are the size of chloroplasts larger than mitochondria, uh, D-shaped structure and bounded by double membrane. Okay, these chloroplast structure include tilakoid and stroma. Okay, tilakoid, okay, like a coin. This coin, we just use stack of tilakoid. So, this is a we call grade okay we call it grade okay this is a grade so this grade they are interconnecting with another grade okay inside the chloroplast double membranes and they have a fluid inside here we call stroma Okay. It's an internal fluid outside the telacord is a stroma. The inside the stroma the contains of enzyme. So the conclusion for chloroplast they have three compartments. The first one is an intermembrane space, it's a between outer and inner membrane. Number two, we have stroma. Okay, fluids and we have tilakoid numerous. The figure show a chloroplast. The gray color is a tilakoid and stack of tilakoid we call a granule and inside the double membrane, okay, outer membrane and inner membrane. Uh, we have uh, fluids, inter, internal fluids we call stroma. Inside the stroma, they are contains of enzyme and ribosomes. Okay. Between outer and inner membrane, we call it the membrane space. Okay, that's all for chloroplasts.